and we decide whether someone's successful just as quickly. We go on height, and we're right to. An American study found business graduates earn $600 a year more for every extra inch of height. And in US presidential elections, the taller man has won 17 out of 21 times. So, to test whether size really does matter, we took two actors to the streets of New York. Marcus and Melvin are almost identical. Same age, similar looks, just one obvious difference. Marcus is six foot four, and Melvin's five foot two. But who looks more successful at work? First, tall man Marcus. He's a lawyer, doctor, and then accountant. I would say he's an executive who likes sports. Probably earns about maybe about half a million a year. 54, 58, probably close to 60. A year, 60,000. I would say maybe 100, 100,000 a year. He looks like a tycoon. Now, short man Melvin. He's little. <laughs> maybe a cook. <laughs> Quick, a cook. I think he's a quiet guy and he's not very happy. I think he's having a difficult situation right now. So he earns about an average income, nothing fancy but enough to live on, yeah. Minimum wage, I guess, um, 20000 a year. On average, they credited Melvin with a meager $20,000 income and Marcus with a whopping $220,000. All thanks to a difference of 14 inches. I wish I was his size, to tell you the truth. 